Hello and welcome to this cryptocurrency technical analysis, which I honestly believe is going to be one of the most informational videos that I have ever done for you. We're going to be managing a trade together live in the time. I'm going to be explaining the reasons for this trade, what I'm looking for next, in which I can only say I really hope we are going to be doing all of this together. Together as a team, we are going to crush this chart. We are going to win this trade and we're going to bank some very nice profits. So if that sounds nice to you, I hope that you can pay attention, full attention, block the distractions, listen to every word I say. I'm not going to say a word unless it's important. So with that said, I'm going to pick up right where I left off yesterday's video, where we were obviously talking about a long trade opportunity, and I was explaining why I was bullishly biased wanting to see higher prices. So you had that magic scenario come together. I openly told you, for free, I'm bullishly biased here on YouTube. Along with that, I gave you the next long opportunity off of this daily zone, which if you remember, we actually had four very strong confluence levels. This was a golden opportunity, should we be given it? And given it, we were. And this is why I stress together, because many of you, if you paid close attention and listened to what I was saying, that was the magic box where we wanted that long opportunity. And you can see how we absolutely timed the low there perfectly. I know many of you have taken that trade. Even if you haven't, still good to pay close attention to this video. But I know a lot of you did via the comments on YouTube and via the comments off of the Twitter post that I made, you know, asking who managed to get that perfect long entry off the daily confluence zone that I gave you in yesterday's update. If you did, then you are now a happy person sat in great profits. Yes, this is the CC pool money making way. That was obviously the target that we had. That's obviously the reaction that we had at absolute low. I love to see these type of comments, people making money alongside us. Let's see, take profit one, will be a nice weekend, managing to get in that entry around that daily zone. Yes, over here, great technical analysis, another person getting in, another person getting in here, the wick came and I made a good long trade. Okay, <laughs> this is kind of funny, right? This is Jamie from yesterday's video. Uh, he's also learning and he's managed to also get into that long trade, another person getting into that long trade. You know, we had a lot of people perfection getting into the long trade this guy getting into the long trade and this this comment that made me laugh the most thank you daniel cc pool levels always work i can trust you blindly also with another successful long trade there so i know a lot of you are in this so i'd like to explain now the management side this is where you've got to pay attention because this is where i'm going to be sharing some real key information i'm going to start off with uh, you know, just citing some of the posts that I made with inside my Discord, just so we can look back and see some of the price action at this lower term time frame. Okay, so there's a few ways that we could have originally got this entry trigger. Okay, and I'm going to show you now here. Original, this is on a five minute time frame, was simply a wick into the level. Okay, so a visible reaction. This could be enough for us to say, okay, this is an aggressive long but we've now hit that very strong support level that Daniel gave me. He's told us he's bullish. He's told us he has confidence. He's told us that he's definitely looking to take this long trade. This for me is a visible reaction and opportunity number one. Well, if you were too scared to take this, you were actually gifted two other opportunities. This is now on the three minute time frame. The original wick, which wasn't acceptable long, but if you wanted a little bit more confirmation or a little bit smaller of a stop loss, you actually retested the CC Fibonacci to the absolute dollar, which was long opportunity number two, or long opportunity number three is low, high, higher low, higher high. The trend change here. Okay, so you had three long opportunities down here. And I even told my team, the stop loss is going to be below that daily wick or simply at your entry. But below the daily wick would be below this wick. That's a very good place to keep the stop loss. That's where I've got my stop loss. I'd just like to show you this in a little bit detail zoomed in. You can see how the CC there is the absolute dollar low. Okay, and that's what we call precision. I know sometimes I get a little bit of, uh, you know, a little bit of people saying, oh, Daniel, you've just simply renamed the golden pocket to the CC. And I, I you know, obviously a lot of people are just going to think that. But I've not just come on here and renamed a level. There's an actual reason and statistics behind me not renaming, but actually recreating the level, right? So the level has changed. The CC is not the golden pocket. There is a difference. And I know a lot of people say it's just a slight difference. What does that matter? Well, when you're a trader such as myself and you want precision, you want the best entries, 
or that slight difference can make the world of difference. It really can sometimes be the difference between a winning and losing trade, an entry or simply not getting an entry. So while some people can mock me for my, you know, adjusting levels, going for the real precision, you know, if, if you, if you, you know, you can see in the results and I see in my own statistics of trading, this type of small changes, this type of precision is what makes me the trader I am. And that's what I'm going to say on that as well. But we had several long opportunities down at that low. Okay. And then we also have the stop loss placement. So here we've then had, obviously, now we can see a strong bounce to the upside. Remind you, a strong bounce here. We're talking about from low to high, already 3% bounce. I know some people might think, well, 3% bounce, what am I going to do with that? Let me tell you, whether you're a trader like me that's trading with multi-millions, well, then you can imagine 3% on a multi-million trade size is, is very nice. But even if you're trading with $10, 3% is 3% at the end of the day. If you trade with $10, you know, you're still making money at the end of the day. And you have to be in the mindset right now of, if you're only trading with small amounts, then this is still compounding up, okay? If you can continuously do this, you know, every day or get into one good trade like this a week, okay? When you have this high confluence level, this is a golden long opportunity. Not only can you recognize that yourself, but you also have me openly telling you, you know, this is the level that I'm looking for, okay? And then if you obviously lack that confidence, well, then if in the Discord, you can start to get the help of myself, the other coaches, the other, other um, you know, community members here coming together and recognizing this as the opportunity. Well, obviously, then you're not going to be scared to take that trade, but you're going to be more willing to come along with us, right, as a, as a team. And well, from here, we've had a 3% bounce. So what I wanted to say with, you know, if you're trading with small amounts on your demo account, then it doesn't matter, right? It's all about the long-term progress. It's all about getting into this consistency of winning consistently over time. You know, we're not going to win every trade, but we're going for those higher win rates. Okay. We're going for these wins, which are, which are much bigger than our losses. We will take losses, but we're going for that consistent approach. We're going for those strong level of confluences and we're not getting scared. We're not getting emotional. We're taking those trades when we're giving them and we're walking away with profit consistently CC pool style, right? So now we've had this move to the upside. If you haven't already, I'd be saying that now is a decent time to take profit one. Why? Well, when we zoom in down here, okay, we zoom in here. This was our long entry, right? So this is where we planned for that long entry. We then, as you saw in the group, had several opportunities at that low to take the long as well. There's no excuse to not take this unless you were asleep then that's an acceptable excuse, I suppose. You know, some people miss this because they were asleep and, you know, that's uh, fine. But if you were awake, then there's no excuse to have missed the trade. Okay, from here, we've had a nice rise to the upside. So why can we say this is a nice take profit one? Well, as you can see, this was our high that brought us down to this low. So this has currently been hit. Okay, we're talking about it's been hit as pretty much as we're speaking in the last candle. So I think, in my opinion, this is a acceptable take profit one if you've not already done it. Okay, I've personally already done it. If you haven't, this is a nice take profit one. What, what does this do in your situation? Well, there's a few things that you can ex, you know, understand now. So if we were looking for this as the original trade setup, which gives us our entry, stop loss, and invalidation. Okay, so I'm gonna pull this tool here, which gave us our long opportunity. Again, as posted in my group, the stop loss is below the daily wick. So now we have our entry, and our invalidation with the stop loss. And the target here can be up, well, it could be up to $30,000, for example. But for here, we're just gonna pull it up to this last high up here. So why would we, if we're, let's say we're even going for $30,000, right? Why would we look to take profit one at $23,300? Well, there's a reason here. And that is because there is the possibility that we come up, take these highs, and then come back down. And by locking in a take profit one here, and if you wanna know my percentages, I have given the answer to this in my questions channel on the Discord. I was actually asked the question, how much percentage take profit should we take on our take profit one on this trade? If you want that exact percentage, I'm gonna say this is for the champions inside of the Discord. So if you want that information, all you need to do is come over to chartchampions.com and you know the mentorship that we give here, it's like this, but on steroids. It's gonna be times 100 better. You can only imagine if I'm giving this sort of information information on the YouTube, what you will get inside the group is like times 100 better, right? 
But I digress, and I will just say this, that this is a good take profit one percentage, okay? Um, and why? Because even though we're looking for higher prices and higher targets, this will protect us should we be on the wrong side of this trade going forwards, and it does crash down from here, okay? This just is giving us this scenario where we're going to make money whatever happens next. And as a trader, if you can say that, I'm going to make money whatever happens next, that's a lovely position to be in. You can now go about your weekend, you can go about your day, you can go about maybe be in this trade for the next month, right? And you're in this lovely feeling of, I'm making profits, whatever happens next. If we totally crash from here, that was a profitable winning trade. And that is what we love to be in. This is what at Chart Champions we thrive on. Love to be in that position because now I can relax. Okay. So if we do the scenario, once again, a scenario, because this is a three, three, three touch, third touch setup. So <laughs> a third touch setup, right? So if we do something like that, reject off the top of the channel and come back down, this will ends in a winning trade, whatever happens. Why? Because you'd have locked in that take profit one at this at this level, okay, or before. So we pay ourselves. We pay ourselves. So if this does move down, we've protected ourselves. And what you have to remember is there's no shame in taking profit here. And let's say we take profit percentage one, doesn't mean close the trade, but take profit percentage one, and then we pump to $30,000, $50,000. We're still making money on the rest of that trade that's running. We've just protected ourselves should we drop from here. We've made money whatever happens on next on that long. And if we do get a massive pump from here, well, brilliant. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Why? Because then we can make even more money on the rest of that long trade that's running. Okay, so I hope this video has made sense to you. I really hope that it's made sense to you. I wanted to, in Pacific, just cover that trade and give a little bit more explanation because I know not everybody's inside the Discord, right? Of course, if you're in the Discord, you're all up to date on everything uh, as it's happening. But for the people that aren't and for the people that are watching here on YouTube, I don't generally do these type of updates for YouTube, but I feel in a little bit special here on a Friday evening. So I thought, hey, I'll give you a little bit of a bonus as a one-off. Um, <laughs> but here you go. Uh, you know, great to see people making profits alongside us. Blinding trust me, that's a bit crazy, but you got to <laughs> do what you got to do. And uh, yeah, obviously great outcome on that trade. And I will say this, yesterday's video didn't reach the 2,500 likes target for the Elliott Wave. But if you do want to see this Elliott Wave count, uh, obviously I was re referring to the one that I made one year ago. And just so you can see, that was the one year old prediction. Back in February 2022, made the prediction of coming down to around $15,000. Okay, and then this was an actual updated count that I'd done on my bullish Elliott Wave count in September while we were at $20,000 before we had this drop. Where you can see here, the Prediction was a little bit of a rise, dropped to $15,000, big pump to the upside. And this is how that progressed. Rise, dropped to $15,000, and now we're starting that pump to the upside. So I'll tell you once again, if you, wanna, if you want me to release those trading secrets to you here, all you need to do is hit that like button, hit the subscribe, tick the notification bell. Let's go for 2,500 likes. This video is definitely gonna get more views than that. That I know for sure. Uh, so all you need to do is hit that like button and you're gonna be able to see some of the secrets that I'm giving away. If you don't want to wait that long, well, you can get it over in the Champions live stream. The last Champions live stream that i done, I did go over my Elliott Wave count. I'm actually going to go over Elliott Waves once again this Sunday where I've got another Champions live stream. So if you want to get in on me, if you want to get on, on, the, on, on these live trading streams, we've got the live trading streams. We've got the new theory, the new style of our videos. You've got the speed run modules. This is the whole course done in five minutes shortened videos. You got the vault where you got all our templates. You got the glossary. You got the video library. You got pretty much everything you're ever going to need when it comes to trading. My confidence is high. So is that of my coaches alongside me. And yeah, I'm just happy to say, let's go CC Paul. Uh, it's brilliant scenario, brilliant training environment that we're in right now. Loving every single minute of it. So I truly hope that you are taking full advantage alongside this market with me right now. If you're not, you know what to do. Head over to chartchampions.com. I'm so happy to talk about this because I know and I can see the results that we're producing, the people that we're helping and how they really are, you know, having a positive 
good experience. Okay, we've made so many changes. We listened to so much feedback. We implemented the changes you wanted to see. And I think it's clear as day, right? From 2023, we're a new team. We're stronger than ever and we're trading better than we ever have. And I think that just is inspired by the confidence that we have right now, just the loving feeling that we've got going on inside us and the, you know, the results that are speaking for themselves, the predictions, the levels the community aspect, the changes, the positive changes and an environment that we've put ourselves in. It's beautiful. It really is. So I hope that you've enjoyed this little bit of a special video. Um, and if you want more from myself and the team, head over and catch us inside of the mentorship. And from there, you can get in on the Discord too, right? So thank you ever so much, everybody. I'm going to wrap this up here. And I'm going to say thank you ever so much. Boom, boom, boom. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers, everybody. And CC Paul, let's go team. <laughs> uh, I'll end, of course, actually with the legal trade disclaimer. Of course, I've talked about trades here. You have to remember, no financial advice. Do your own research. Don't trust me blindly. And all trades on the paper, demo trade accounts. Cheers, everybody. And goodbye. <laughs>